The Tinel sign is described for various body regions with the aim to evoke symptoms that are characteristic of peripheral nerve entrapment by tapping along the distribution of the affected nerve. Valdez et al. in 2013 and Montgomery in 2020 evaluated the Tinel sign among other tests for carpal tunnel syndrome on its diagnostic accuracy. The results? Positive likelihood ratios ranging from 0.82 to 2.95 and negative likelihood ratios between 0.57 and 0.77, which translates to only a weak clinical value. And you are better off to using a validated cluster for CTS, which you can watch by a click in the top right corner. To conduct the test, the patient is in sitting position with the forearm and hand placed comfortably on the treatment bench. The examiner then uses two fingers to tap on the median nerve at the wrist. Some authors recommend to tap along the entire distribution of the median nerve from the index finger to the medial forearm. The test is considered positive in case tingling in the thumb index finger, middle finger, and or lateral half of the ring finger are reproduced.